Hi guys, it's Ariel from Seattle Coffee Gear and today we are going to be making a Manhattan with a coffee infused vermouth and uh, for the vermouth I have ch or for the vermouth I chose uh, Rivada. It's um, an Italian brand of vermouth that has some, some kind of fruity spicy notes to it and the coffee that I chose is um, Victrola Coffee Roasters Mpanga Honey Process Coffee. It um, has notes of graham cracker, cherry cola, and maple. So I figured that would kind of add another layer of complexity to the vermouth and give us a really tasty drink. So here I have my mixing glass filled with ice and we're gonna get started. So it's going to be two ounces of bourbon. And then we are going to do one ounce of the infused vermouth. And then my little secret is I actually like to add a bar spoonful of Luxardo Maraschino liqueur. They use the entire cherry, so the pit and the fruit, so it has kind of a fruity, but a, also a slightly bitter almond note to it. So just a bar spoonful of that. And last but not least, we are going to add two dashes of aromatic bitters. And now we're going to give it a stir to make sure that everything gets incorporated and chilled. And what you can tell is you'll start to see condensation build up and the ice is also going to start to feel looser um, once you've had it chilled enough. be about right. So now I'm just going to strain it into a glass. And now we're going to garnish it with a cherry. And now we're going to sip it, see how we did. I definitely get the fragrance of the coffee right off the bat. Um, it's a very subtle note. It adds almost a kind of like a cherry, cola, chocolatey note to the vermouth that we added in there. Um, and it really just kind of brings everything together. Uh, the bourbon is great. Overall, I think we've got a really good drink here. Um, thank you for joining me. Don't, for hit, don't forget to click like and subscribe. Leave a comment below. Um, and we will see you next time. Cheers.